Hashtag Unexpected Canvas is Maker Village's latest public art installation initiative. The details are above my pay grade, but do watch Facebook and Twitter. Rome is just on the brink of exploding, especially Broad Streets. I just, I'm really excited to be a part of it. Uh, of course, if, if Rome had a crown jewel, Broad Street would be it. I just hope to see it grow and continue. So what possessed you to take on this project? As is often the case, I was sitting in Swift and Finch and someone asked for a crazy idea. I said, oh, me, me, me. And I came up with one and didn't think it through at all. I came in prepared to paint exactly like I do on a 9 by 12 canvas, but it's plywood at 60 feet. We've changed materials, changed initial concept, but it's going to be just as great in the end because the color is going to be there and the interest is going to be there just without the texture. Working with the wood was one of the best parts because I had no idea what I was doing. We primed it and then it just took on a life of its own. This is an amazing opportunity. I couldn't be more grateful for the chance. Trisha made a huge leap of faith and it's been scary. I've never taken on a project locally or publicly and on such a large scale. The community so quickly invested in it. People would help, children would come paint. The construction crew upstairs were incredibly supportive. We had a great time. And a very fun surprise was the feeling of collaboration. The guys are working inside, ripping out the old rock, working out the old ceiling, and it feels like a part of something bigger instead of just sitting at my desk. It was very scary. I jumped in very quickly without thinking about it, and in the hullabaloo of the day or two before we started, there were so many things that I didn't anticipate. I had no way to. I'd never worked with plywood. I'd never installed anything outside. And it was two or three days before I realized, oh no, this is where I live. I'm sad that it's over, but also excited for the next challenge. It's over, we did it.